Wraith begins the story of Matt and Laura right at a point where most stories would end because in the very first chapter that both characters appear, Laura dies. But that's not the end of her story. Because she becomes a ghost, a wraith, who can only contact Matt. And she has, she's a restless ghost because she had a mission to complete, and that was she was on a government surveillance operation and was on her way back to report to Washington when she was killed. And just in, by, beside the diner where her car was flipped into the air and crashed was a young cop who was disgraced and who was contemplating a bleak future, heard the crash, rushed out, and was there at the moment that she died holding onto her hand, and a bond was forged between them, and he is the only one to whom she can appear now. So the lore of ghosts is, says that ghosts are creatures or beings that have something more to do, and that's why they don't pass on when, when their body dies, that there's something they remain on Earth to do. And Laura is that type of wraith. There's something she has to do. She has to report what she has seen. What has she seen? She's seen what's on the cover of the book.